Our lockdown continues with Billy just three miles from the DeSoto Hotel. In the Concordia Cemetery, he heads to an area referred to as the Three Trees, which is known for paranormal activities such as tall shadow figures, glowing orbs of light, and even unexplained growling sounds. This is also a documented site where serial killer Richard Ramirez, known as the Night Stalker, worshipped the devil. I'm going to say a prayer that should clear evil spirits. What I think it's going to do is really piss them off. Through the blood of Jesus, Concordia is redeemed out of the hand of the devil and all of her sins are forgiven. Concordia is justified and made righteous just as if she had never sinned. She is set apart for God. Her body is a temple for the Holy Spirit, redeemed and cleansed by the blood of Jesus. Amen. They know that I'm here. They know what I'm trying to do. In fact, Within seconds of completing the prayer, a crow flies out of one of the three trees directly towards Billy while shrieking loudly. And as Billy looks at where the bird came from, he sees three unexplained dark figures directly behind the three trees. This causes him to panic and fear, so he hides behind one of the trees on the right-hand side of the screen. Watch very closely in the center of your screen as these three dark unknown figures seem to move in a strange strange tandem march from left to right, leaving the trees. When we zoom in on the three figures, our visual analysis determines that they don't appear to be living people because as they move, their outlines seem to undulate in an odd wave-like manner. It seems as though everything is happening in threes for Billy. Even on his way to the cemetery, he filmed this billboard. Billy is now caught between these synchronicities of evil. What does this mean for him? My heart just dropped right over there. I don't know how much more of this I can take tonight. I have chicken skin right now. I'm so scared. This is unbelievable. I just want to get out of here. Billy is so utterly terrified and panicked because he keeps seeing these same three figures all around him that the police are called. Billy tells the two police officers what he is seeing, but the question remains, are these trespassers, devil worshippers, or three demonic entities that have been seen here before? Back at the De Soto Hotel, Aaron and I seem to be poking this demon with a stick and it's starting to show its aggravation. On the upper floors, we have secretly placed GoPro cameras so that we can monitor the floors and residents. All of a sudden, one of the cameras, which we have secured extremely well with clamps and heavy gaff tape, unexplainably seems to get ripped off the wall by an unseen force. 30 minutes later, some of the De Soto Hotel residents discover the camera on the ground. It's a camera. These things are expensive. I are now separated in the massive basement at the De Soto Hotel. I feel we are both starting to lose ourselves mentally because of this powerful entity.